Alright guys, so what's up? It's me, Blaze Cube. And as you can see, I am not in my house, but I am in my shed. So basically, I might start making videos in here. It's quiet, I like it out here. But besides the point, um, we have really got to talk about this. So basically, the rapper Lil Uzi Vert, we all know him. He is like world famous right now. He has dropped the biggest song of the summer, XO Tour Life. So basically, Lil Uzi Vert... Well, let's just say if you listened to him back in 2016 and 15 when he had, like, really good music. And, you know, it's 2017, 2018. He's lost it. 2017, like, towards May. After EXO Tour Life, his music was trash. After EXO Tour Life. I'm only speaking the truth. He had some good songs after that, but they weren't even his best. Like, I know Uzi's better than what he was doing. And his music just sucked for a while. But this year, 2018, a couple weeks ago, Lil Uzi Vert, he released a song called Mood. And it, oh my god, it sounded like the old Lil Uzi Vert. Like, I didn't feel like I was listening to someone that I've never listened to before. This is the Uzi I know. He wrote this song called Mood, basically, and it sounds just like, well... Mood sounds like his old music, like 2015, 2016, and it just sounded so much better than the crap he's been releasing lately. And this, well, basically, a couple months ago, Lil Uzi Vert had a fan say, I miss the old Uzi on SoundCloud, and Uzi says, I miss that too, but trust me, I'm going to turn this around fast. So basically what that means, oh, well, with um a devil emoji like the smiling one you know in the fire emoji so and whenever we see uzi with those two emojis you already know he's bringing some heat he's we're gonna bring heat so basically why why uzi does not like signing and why he says it was the worst thing he'd ever done in his life well that is because uzi has not been able to release his good music that we want to hear so all the crap music that we heard on his new album was all Atlantic Records' fault. So basically, they're not letting Uzi release the music he wants, rather than the music they want. And Uzi does not like that because he is losing a lot of supporters, and for that reason. So, Uzi had written the song Mood, he released on World Star Hip Hop, if you have not heard it. Well, basically, basically Uzi... He's going to be releasing the music we want him to release and not just the music that Atlantic Records wants him to release. So basically, I guess uh, Uzi misses the SoundCloud days. He was still getting paid and stuff, but not, I don't know if it's as much, but basically Uzi is going to start releasing the old music. This is like the Love is Rage 1 Uzi, the Money Longer Uzi. This is going to be the old Uzi that we know, not this new Uzi that's always... Writing the crap like sauce it up. That song sucked, in my opinion. But yeah, this has been my video for today. Let me know what you think in the comments. Leave a like and subscribe. And uh, let's try and make it to 400 this year. I know you can make 400 and maybe over this year. Let's get my channel to 500 by the end of this year. Let's try it. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, like and subscribe. We need all the support we can get. But let me know your opinion in the comments. And uh, yeah, as always, I love you guys and peace.